David. You see, I said you'd go. David, do you want a new snorkel or not? Coming. I'm longer flipper, so I can We'll see. see. Come on. John, good to see you again. And yourself, Mr. Jenner. Long time. Mr. Edwards about. Sure, he's in the office. You tell him to line up the drinks. Come back. He was what? He was killed instantly. <laughs> An inshore breeze did it. He'd gone out to photograph the sunset. When wham, down came the coconut. <laughs> Always warn our guests. Damn it, they're the size of footballs and considerably heavier. What, the coconuts or your guests? Yes, it hasn't been all that amusing for business, actually, Sam. Well, I'm sorry, but well, what a crazy way to go. You seem to be pretty full up right now. Oh, yes. The start of the season was very slow. <laughs> you know, because this guy stood under a palm tree when the wind was blowing up. Huh? Oh, sorry, man. Awful fuss, police, newspapers. Anyway, you're looking the same as ever, Sam. Oh, yes, yes. I'm heading north to the Bahamas. Good fishing? No, so, so. But the marine life's been diminishing somewhat in these waters. There's no question about that. Now, you'll stay for dinner. You have something special on the menu tonight? Of course, that woman of that woman! Come on, get close to please! Come on, the catch! Okay, let's go! What is it? Some kind of monster? Jeez. Out of that, eh? Hey, uh, stand well back, please. Ladies and gentlemen, we stand oh, well back. This thing is dangerous, man. Yes. Oh, look at those things. Oh, look at that peak. Does it actually float, Denzel? Of course it floats. Use your head, baby. Powerful swimmer, too. Just like you, darling. Oh, pull the boat easily. Is he a snapper turtle? No, snapper turtles don't get that big. But be careful, don't get too near it. Slice your hand off like that. Is that true, really? Gentleman's right, ma'am. He won't ever hurt you when he's in the ocean swimming free. You catch him, tip him up on the shore like this. <laughs> then, man, you watch out. I think I'd feel a bit snappish myself if I was in his situation. <laughs> gangway, come on, one side. Hey, man, don't do that. You'll only make him madder than ever. What makes you such an expert? <laughs> Hey, smoke. did you see? <laughs> it don't help to get him all stirred up. Hey, how about getting me stirred up? I'm just thinking, me. Come on, knock it off, everybody. Listen, I want to buy that turtle. Now, how much? Honey, you know what we're going to do? We're going to buy the turtle, we'll take it home, have it polished by an expert, and we'll put it smack in the middle of the living room. Now, how does that grab you? Bernie, that'll be fantastic. Hey, don't you just love him? Go on, honey, buy it. Buy don't it. Don't worry, baby, it's ours already. Great. Okay, now, make me a price. I've already sold it, man. Shell and all. <laughs> Look, I'll hey. pay more than anybody. Now, you just tell me what they offered you. No can do, sir. I've already sold it. Who to? To the manager. What manager? To the manager of the hotel man. 
to hear that. He sold it to the manager. Do you know what that means? That means turtle soup tomorrow night. That's what that means. Say what? I never had turtle soup in my entire life. And turtle steaks. They're delicious. Better than beef steaks if you cook them right. Oh, wait, you, when you eat oh, that thing... Oh, they're so tender. And the flavour... Mm. Oh, what? Oh, oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. okay. I'll well, get turtle soup as long as I get the shell, because that's all I want. The manager can have everything else. He can have the teeth, the toenails, as long as I get the shell. <laughs> I know my Bernie. He's going to get that shell. Right. Yeah, yes. I say something? You can say anything as long as I get the shell. <laughs> now, look, you've all been discussing the, the destruction, the consumption, and the flavor of this animal. But do you have any idea how old it is? Well, it's older than any of us here. So what? And my guess is that he's been cruising these waters for well over 200 years. Now, that means he was around when George Washington was president. When Napoleon lost out at Waterloo. I don't think we need a lecture from you, buddy boy. Now, hold on a second. I want you to consider all these facts before you make any kind of a decision. Forget it. Okay, how do we get him back to the hotel? Hey, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We'll all get together on this, huh? And we'll drag this monster straight up into the kitchen, huh? No, no, man. No, man. No, man. No, man. No, man. Look, the men to show up mark. for the ladies. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Okay. That's what we're gonna have. Ladies yeah. handle the cameras. Yeah. Men pull the turtles. Yeah. Okay, ready? Yeah. Let's give it a try. Get back on the sled till I escape the shore. What are you talking about? We got him tied up in a net. We're we'll dragging all of our men right into the ocean. Garbage. Come on, let's go. All together now. Sorry, I must apologize. He's mad about animals. Back home, he's got every kind of animal. He talks to them. He loves them, you see. Come along now, David. There's nothing else we can do. Louise! Louise! Let him go! Take off the net and let him go! He's right, you know. I guess we all know that. Why don't you shut up? All right, David, you've had your say. Now let's go. No! David! Run Don't you understand that? Yes, of course I do, but... But what? Look, who owns this turtle? Oh, we do. The hotel's bought it. Then do me a favor, will you? Sell him to me. Please. 
You don't know my son. He'll go crazy if it's slaughtered. He'll become hysterical. Could just go and pull him away. Just pull him away! Graham, look at this. Look how well he's getting along with that turtle. It's amazing. There. He's feeling much better now. If I let him go, the fisherman will only catch him again. I'll pay them not to. Please let me buy it. How, how much? A thousand dollars? Look, just pull him away. Hold it. I want that turtle. Two thousand dollars. I didn't expect an auction. That's too bad, buddy. You got one. Two thousand. Very well, then. Two thousand five hundred. Three thousand. Oh, gee, honey. It isn't worth three thousand dollars. Now, you stay out of this, Mildred. Three thousand. Oh. Graham. In all decency, you know that you should sell to the lowest bidder. I already told you once. Shut up. You told me that once, and I didn't like it. Well, I don't like it now. Yeah? Four thousand. Baby! I agree with Sam. The first bid was plenty. I'm sorry, Mr. Berners. Oh, come on. Thank you. Pardon me, Mr. Edwards. But you can't let him go. We caught him. That turtle is the fiercest turtle I have ever caught. It took all five of us to land him. All right, Willie. You'll get your money, I guarantee it. And a bonus, too. A hundred dollars a man if you let him go immediately, all right? <laughs> you're crazy. There is a condition. You've got to promise you'll not try and catch him again. You'll give him a real chance to get away, OK? No. It's a deal, Shakespeare. Look at where we go! David? not in his room. He's probably gone down to have breakfast. That's what he did yesterday. He's a growing boy. He gets hungry. I told him not to. This 
must be kept confidential. Absolutely confidential. What do you mean, David? He's missing. gone. Perhaps he's gone for an early morning swim, a climb on the rocks. No, he has not. We've made inquiries. We insist that you call the police. Uh, please, it's, it's quieter in my office. Yeah, well, as long as we can see some action. If you don't call the police, then we will. Perhaps the search part is organised. Everybody flying about like they was crazy. Search high and low. How long has he been missing? Nobody know. He just ain't in his bed this morning. And Mr. Edwards, he go like a zombie man. Yeah, he's worried about business, huh? Nobody gonna believe it. Look, just say what you saw, Willie. We got early. 4 a.m. We walked two miles before light. Okay? Okay. The sun come up. We see the right ahead of us. 30 yards. 50 yards, Look man. Look at 50. We see him. And we don't believe it, man. What? We see this old monster turtle swimming away. And the boy, that boy yesterday. What? What? Sit high on the turtle's back, right high over the sea like a horse. You got to believe us. We all see it. You moonstruck. You sunstruck. No man. It's a gospel man. We call out. Boy riding high. His feet don't touch the water. And that turtle, he go like clappers, man. We row fast, man. We call out, hey, you boy, you come on back, boy. We take you home. We call and we call. The mummy waiting for you. He never looked back. He seemed so happy. Man, it was more than happiness. And anyway, that turtle, we can match his speed. No, sir. Which way were they heading? North to north. Bravo, Victor Bravo, this is Juliet Kilo. Juliet Kilo, my position 350, St. Jude's Bay, seven miles. Air search negative, over. Okay, roger, and out. Nothing from the helicopter so far. Anything? No. Maybe the fisherman imagined it. The boy took a walk just to do some exploring. No, he took his new flippers and his snorkel with him. They saw him, all right. Is he a good swimmer? Yes, he can swim like a, like a fish. Victor Bravo, Victor Bravo, this is Juliet Kilo. Juliet Kilo, my position 350, St. Jude's Bay, seven miles, air search negative, over.
It's a kind offer. If I have any news, I'll radio. you. All right. Thanks, Sam. Of all the damnedest things. The news will be all over the island by now. Security, security, security. Midnight court calling St. Jude Coast Guard. Midnight call to Midnight Court. This is St. Jude's Coast Guard receiving you loud and clear. Go ahead, over. He seems so happy. Man, it was more than happiness. It would have been a sin to stop him. Midnight Court, this is St. Jude's Coast Guard. I'm listening 3182. What is your message, over? No message. I guess I was dreaming. 